Hi, I'm Amy Smith and I'm a Norwex Independent Consultant. I wanted to show you today um, what sold me on Norwex. At first when I heard about Norwex I was pretty skeptical and I'm sure you guys are too. You hear that you can clean with just microfiber and water and it sounds too good to be true. And I was the same way. So um, I'm a nurse. I decided to be a nurse and I just I wanted to see some proof and evidence that it really worked. And um, so I'm here to show you that it does. This is the test that sold me on it. Um, first of all, I'm going to, this is raw chicken. And some of you might be grossed out by this, but I'm just going to go ahead and put it on my counter here. And I'm going to rub it on my counter. And so we can test and see if it's really removing all of the chicken from the counter. So that's what we do there. Just rub it on. And I'm going to test it with a protein swab. Now this is a protein swab that's not provided to me by Norwex. It's something that we buy um, from a third party, Hygiena, and they provide protein swabs to food inspectors and the food industry uh, to go in and inspect the sanitary conditions in restaurants and things. I like the health department when they go in and make sure all the um, the restaurants are up to code and everything. They'll use swabs like this just to make sure that things are being cleaned up nicely. If you go online, you can search about the size of a protein molecule compared to bacteria and viruses, and you'll see um, that proteins are smaller than bacteria and viruses. So you know if you're getting the protein off the surface, you are pretty much getting everything off of the surface. So I'm just going to go ahead and swap my counter here just to prove that it's contaminated. Not like you really needed proof, but um, just to prove that these swaps really work. So I'm going to go ahead and break the liquid and um, send it in there. And you can see already that this is turning from green, which is clean, to purple. It's already turning very quickly. And you see the scale here. I don't know how well you can see it from there, but green up here and all the way down to dark purple. You can see this swab. It didn't take long. So. Now that I've done that, I'm going to take my wet and viral cloth. This was just done, um, just rinsed with water. That's it. No chemicals. So I'm going to go ahead and take it, clean my surface with it, and you'll notice that this is my dirty surface. I'm going to go ahead and clean right here too, just to prove that with your cloth, it sucks it into the fibers. It grabs a hold of it and it's not going to let it go until you rinse it down the sink. Um, and so I showed this area wiping with my cloth just to show it does not cross contaminate. So I will swab both surfaces now with this swab. So we'll do this, we'll swab up here, and I'll even swab my cloth. Okay? And I'll do both sides because I can't remember which side was dirty. So both sides with my swap, and I will prove to you that it's not releasing those proteins and contaminants. Okay, and you can see, shake it around for good measure, green is clean. Not even a hint of purple in there. It's amazing, it really is, but you can see the difference. I swabbed not only where I rubbed the chicken, I also swabbed up where I contaminated the counter, or it should have contaminated the counter, and I swabbed my cloth. And that just proves to you that the Norwex sucks up everything into the cloth, and it's not going to release it until you rinse it, all that debris down the sink, and rub it together, and then the silver is going to work to con um, purify the cloth as it dries. So it's an amazing test, really. That's the proof right there.